Hello guys, it's Brandy Janae. Welcome if you're new, welcome back if you're returning. In today's video, I am going to be unboxing this package from Once More With Love. So if you're interested in seeing what's inside this box, please be sure to go ahead, like this video, subscribe to my channel, and stay tuned. Okay, great. So again, I have this package from Once More With Love. That's oncemorewithlove.com if you're interested. This is the anniversary bundle. You guys, I don't think I have ever stalked a shop more in like my whole life. So I did get the anniversary bundle and here's one of the things. This tissue paper is so pretty. Once More With Love. Let me see if it has any I figured it would have some of the billing information. So I got the anniversary bundle with the, uh, it says claw machine for the Hobonichi cousin. And so this is one of the parts of it. And it's so cute. Sorry about the plastic. It's so cute. I actually watched her do an unboxing of this, which I like never, ever, 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 ever do. But I was trying to decide for Black Friday what I wanted. And I really was like, eh, I don't really know. Just because I didn't really have too much in mind. And then I saw her unbox this anniversary bundle and I was like, I have to have it. So literally I like stalked the website for ever <laughs> because I wanted to get it. I wasn't sure how many there were and I really, really, really wanted it after I saw it. So yeah, stock the website. So I'm so happy that I was able to get it. I purchased this on November 25th. It literally just got here today. Today is December 19th. So it did take quite a while, but I'm super excited about it. So, oh, and then I also ordered, I don't know what's all in here. It looks like everything was packaged together. So hopefully it'll say what the anniversary stuff is versus what my regular stuff is. So I know this came in it. This is one of the clean color dot markers. And this color is English lavender. So love that. I know this is in the anniversary bundle and I've been seeing people use these and I think it's so cute. It's like one of the little keychains and it looks like the claw machine. Love it. And then the washi, which is also in the claw machine pattern. Super cute. Ooh, I need to get my nails done. Mm. And then an enamel pin that says winner. If you didn't know, I also collect enamel pins. So I'm super excited to add this to my collection. But it does say winner and it's very, very, very pretty. I love how it fits with the whole claw theme, claw machine theme. And then we have this, which is post-it notes and the sticky part is on this side which is cool but it's a claw machine so cute and then this oh, again this is like the it says it's a munchkin ornament plushie charm but obviously when you play the claw machines like a lot of times the prizes will come in one of these little balls so i just thought that was like very clever then we have this claw machine die cut sticker I'm assuming these are like freebies. So this is Once More With Love in the hollow. This is says Scribble Prints Co. Happy Mail. So this also must be a freebie. I love the quote, life is short by the stickers. <sighs> Even though don't do that well i can't do that because i'm on a no spin for december y'all it's been hard like who it's been hard but i'm doing it i'm doing it it's been really hard though i ain't gonna lie so then there is a what's this called once more with love seven year sampler did i order this 
I don't know, you guys. Then there's this Once More With Love seven year sampler. I love this one because this is like the Simply Gilded one. Those are so cute. It's like so much, I don't know. Then we have the Scribble Prince Co. Once More With Love. Maybe this is the, uh, I did order an Oops pack too. That's supposed to be 20 sheets. So maybe these are part of that, I don't know. But this is another Scribble Prince Co. Once More With Love collab in more hollow. Let me see. And then we have these Scribble Prince Co. And they're the like washi strip headers. Some boxes, overlays. This must be the, oops. I mean, this must be the, uh, no, what is this? I don't know. Cause this one right here says oop stickers <laughs> i don't know what all these stickers are i'm like i don't know if these are just freebies i just dropped them on the floor sorry that's what i'm doing just drop like three on the floor all right so anyway we have these from Scribble Prints Co. Declutter, Me Time, Tidy Up, Take Out, Laundry, Workout, Target Run, Love It in Gold. Here is the November freebie. Here's another die cut. <laughs> All you need is love and pins and stickers, of course. So cute. Then we have this one, Just a Girl Who Decided to Go For It. I love the film Nail Point and Starbucks Run. This is also from... Scribble Prince Co. I don't know why I have all these stickers, but I am here for all of it. Dream Hard, Work Harder, Love. This is also Scribble Prince Co. Payday Laundry and Work. And it looks like there's somebody's name on this. At Kirsten Plans. This one says at Kirsten Plans. This one says at... I don't know what that says. J. Crew plans, maybe? So maybe these are someone's, their freebies. Then we have this one. There's a great big, beautiful tomorrow shining at the end of every day. I love it. With some more stickers. Scribble Prints Co. Happy Mail. That's cute. Then we have uh, more stickers. Once more with love. Okay, I did order this. This is the boba bubble tea because I do love bubble tea or boba tea as I call it. And then this one is hug from behind, which I thought was super cute. And then here is another seven year anniversary favorites. Love. Oh, this is cute. That's from Aura Estelle. Like the different planners that Aura Estelle makes. Then we have these boxes in the Silver Hollow from Scribble Prince Co. I really hope I'm in frame for all of this. I always stand up to film, but today I decided I just didn't feel like it. All right, and so this is the remaining seven and seven or the anniversary bundle. The Hobonichi size. So again, you get these super cute stickers. I love these colors. And the little claw machine is so precious. And then it has this with the washi strips, your headers. That's so cute. And I love all the little, uh, what are these called? I don't know. I can't think. My brain is tired. Anyway, I love it. <laughs> They're cute. And then the wake weekend banner, I love too. So these two sheets of stickers for sure. We got all this other stuff that does not go with this. But, okay. So this, 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 and this, I know for sure is part of the anniversary bundle. I'm assuming that all of these other freebies came 
Maybe because I ordered the anniversary bundle. Maybe because I spent too much. I don't know, but I'm excited. So anyway, that's the anniversary bundle. And I did have a coupon for all of this. But now that I'm looking at it, I'm like, ooh, that anniversary bundle was expensive. I must have just really been... I'm doing something. Let's see. Oh, and then you get this like journaling card with it with like the note on the back. All right. And then I got the extra large oops stickers, like the 20 misfit sheets. And it says any extras are bonuses. So let's see what's in here. I do like buying these because oftentimes the misfits really aren't that bad. <laughs> and even if they are, there's usually at least one sheet that's usable. So it still works. Like this one, cute wheels on the bus. And it is for a Hobonichi cousin. So it's perfect for my size planner. And I am a teacher. But I do see where the offset is a little bit off in some spots but not so much that you can't use them so starting off great we have these bath time ones so that's two sheets zombie not sure why i would need zombie stickers but yeah that's three hairstyling fantastic these will be really good for like hair appointments so there's four thinking about you that's fun. This is probably romantic, but that's really cute because my son is in the Air Force and he's away. So I feel like that would be really cute to mark the times when I like reach out to him to call him or whatever. And then a <laughs> brow appointment, which I don't actually do, but I love it. <laughs> the little tweezers are hilarious. Backache. Yep. Have those quite a bit. I actually have one right now. So that's fun. Wax melt. I actually just got a wax melt thing today from one of my coworkers, and I love it. I used to do wax melts all the time and then I stopped. But now that I have this cute little wax melt sticker and I got the new wax melt thing, I'll probably start doing it again. So there's that. I love the sticky notes. Sticky notes are like probably my favorite stickers right now. I just think they're so precious. And this one, I can, again, I can see where the offset is just a little bit off, but nothing that's going to prevent you from being able to use it. <laughs> the baby shark is hilarious. Very appropriate for a preschool teacher. Then we have this, which is a September freebie. No school. Oh my gosh. No, it's like they just knew. No school. Perfect for me. The burgers are hilarious headache yes yep unfortunately i have those way too often laptop computers i really like because these can be used for work hot summers yep we have those heat waves hi-ho precious oh my gosh so precious haunted mansion mm, probably don't need those, but I guess they might be okay for like the Halloween season. Munchkin emojis, emojis part nine. Those are hilarious. This little like <laughs> I melted one is so funny to me. Laundry, doing that right now. Donate money, cute. Sometimes you just have to donate and it's good to keep track. And then daycare, don't need, but I could always cut the word daycare off and then just use them to mark school things because these are all preschool appropriate pictures. So I could just certainly cut the word daycare off. So I stopped counting, but let's see. One, slide that out the way. So I got one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 
10, 11, 12 technically, <laughs> 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, and 22 sticker sheets. So yeah, I'm excited. I love it. I, it was definitely worth it. The oops pack was $31, which we all know that if I would have bought these sheets individually, it would have been way more than $31. So that was totally worth it. The hug from behind sticker, which, where did I put that? This, where did I put it? Okay, here we go. So this sticker, which is the same size as these, was $3. So if I would have paid $3 for each one of these, obviously it would have ended up being more than $31. And then the Boba Tea sticker is $2.45. So even this one and this size is $2.45. So that was obviously a very, very, very good value. The anniversary bundle, like I said, for some reason it was $50. I don't really know why I was so enamored with it for that particular price <laughs> i mean it's really cool but i'm like Ugh. um yeah so i don't know why like i was so so in love with it for 50 dollars. other than the fact that i knew that there was a coupon so yeah would i pay 50 dollars for this in real life no it's it's really cute though like don't get me wrong super cute all of these this is the anniversary bundle stuff. I don't know how much a Hobonichi kit is. I don't know. Um, because I haven't ever looked for any Hobonichi kits on there. Obviously, I know post-it notes typically run six, seven dollars or so. Anywhere between five and seven normally. I should have looked up prices. I didn't. But normally I know post-it notes typically run anywhere between like five and seven dollars. Obviously, these Zig color dot markers are probably about three, four dollars typically. I'm not sure how much a journaling card is, but I would imagine probably about three bucks. So we're looking at let's say four, seven, ten for these three. I would imagine that these probably in the store would cost about eight bucks just because <laughs> this I feel like would cost a little bit more. This will probably be closer to about ten. Then I know enamel pins are usually anywhere between like eight and ten dollars in shops. Washi, of course, is typically four or five dollars. And then kits are usually about eight, anywhere between eight and ten. So I think if you add it up just like shop wise, then it's probably realistic. Now, when you factor in the fact that I got all of these. I'm assuming freebie. Well, they have to be freebies. But when you add up the fact that I got all of these things as well, just for free, in addition to these things, my total with the discount ended up being, oh, and then of course you have your shipping. So my total with the discount ended up being $80.08. So I do feel like I have sticker shop value wise more than $80.08. And I only literally really just wanted this for black friday so for me it was totally worth it i don't know if i would do it again i don't know uh i definitely would order some more of the oops packs because those are like my jam i just love buying the oops packs or mystery packs or whatever just because i like to have a variety of things that i may not have noticed on the website or things that i may not have um knew that i even needed so i do really enjoy the oops packs so anyway, I'm going to go ahead and stop rambling. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope that you enjoyed this haul from Once More with Love. I know I absolutely love it. Please leave me a comment and let me know what your favorite thing is. Like, do you think I, you know, made a good decision purchasing what I purchased? Or what is your favorite thing to order from that shop? I'm always looking for new ideas for things to buy. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Be safe, be well, and I'll see you in the next video.